money way. I'm just thinking again. If you know, if if it, if you've got to get this done fairly quickly, I mean, we, we, this could be anywhere in the world for for whatever reason. There is a country that's that's designing uh, or needing a uh, a new uh, currency. How big is it? And we ship it in very large containers. Is is the way to think of it. So if you were to want to transport the entire. Um, currency for a country in an aeroplane, for example, you would need several, many jumbo jets to achieve that. Obviously, it depends a little bit on the size of the country. We've got a we've got a rocky economy, um, a central bank that says uh, we need to quantitatively ease here. What's the process there? I think you might find companies like Deloitte would be very happy to, uh, to to use an approach of quantitative easing that involved dropping notes from an aeroplane, but in practice, it's achieved through the money markets. Uh, in an electronic way. But just take me uh, back once again to the steps of from conception to getting us out or getting these banknotes out into the market. You said it can take as much as or as long as two years. Sometimes as long as two years and it very much depends for example approvals. What is the process in country for approving the design and you can imagine there might be a series of iterations. A note is more than more than just a product. It's a sort of calling card for a nation. So obviously you've got to think about design, but at the same time, complement that with providing the security features that ensure that people can have confidence in the banknote, confidence in the currency that circulates. So how quickly can you do it? The shortest example that I've certainly been involved in is probably about six months, but that is for a very small country and is incredibly quick. Think about colour, style. When you consider the aspects of the design, you then have to, in, in tandem, think about security. And security comes on different levels. The most obvious and, in a sense, most important are the features the public can see. So they can recognise that a note is legal tender and therefore they can trust it when they exchange it between one another. Mm. But then there are features that you incorporate that tellers, for example, at banks or other cash handling institutions can uh, identify that gives just that further level of assurance. Presumably, there is a security issue at times as to how many people knowing that you are physically in the process of designing a new currency. So how, do, how, how many people would be involved in this process? Pretty small group of people would be working on that initially. Say, I, I would think easily within 50 to 100 people would be involved in that, uh, in that process. But Delivery is an incredibly international business. So in the last five years, we've been involved in the production of over 150 different currencies. They're almost, in one sense, works of art. 